Hello friends, in this video we want to teach how to use a multimeter. The multimeter has a pointer that can be set to different mode. It also has a clamp that can be used to measure current. It has two probes that are used to measure voltage. The black wire is connected to the COM base. Now we go to the measurement. The first mode is alternating voltage measurement. For measure voltage, we connect two probes to the source. With this, the display screen shows the voltage. In alternating voltage, if we replace the two props, the voltage will not change. To measure the frequency of alternating current, we press the select button. Now we put two props in the source. In this case, the screen shows the frequency. Now we want to measure voltage of a direct source. For this, we put the multimeter on the direct voltage mode. In this case, it is not possible to measure the voltage of an alternating source. Display does not show anything. To measure direct source voltage, we connect two props to the source in this way. The screen shows the voltage. In the direct source, if we switch the two props, the voltage will be shown with a negative sign. Now we go to the beep test. For this, we put the multimeter on this mode. In this case, if two probes are placed in the same conductive pass, it will beep. To measure the resistance of the wire, press the select button. In this case, if two probes are placed in the same conductive path, the screen will show the resistance of the resistor. In this step, we measure the electric current. We want to measure the electric current of this lamp. For this, we put the multimeter on the ampere mode. Then we put the column inside one of the wires. The screen shows the current. If we put the column inside the other wire, it will show the same value. If we put both wire in the calamp, it does not show anything. If the current is more than the limit, we set the multimeter to 40 amperes or 400 amperes. And for the last part, do the remote voltage test. For this, we set the multimeter to NCV mode. In this case, if we bring the multimeter close the phase wire, it will beep.
and if we get close to the null wire it won't beep thank you for being with me i hope it was useful for you